Hey guys, welcome back. Let's see what happens. Uh, back. So he was like, Yosha! <laughs> Super happy. Get ready. She's gonna come again. Uh, she took the kick. And she can't move now, probably. I'm set. I'm recording. <laughs> Just double check. Um... So, Yazawa is still losing his mind. Uh, we rush out of the room. We're trying to get her. Huh? Whoa, what? She's just standing there. I didn't expect that. Okay. I threw my all at her, how is she still standing? Is she really human? Oh shit! Maybe she isn't human. Uh. <laughs> Who knows? Um. She's smiling. Oh shit! And then... Ah. I was about to say it, but it was already too late. She jumps out of the window? We're on the 10th floor! What? Yeah, that's what I was saying. <laughs> what? How is she gonna survive that? We can hear a crash. Is that her body dropping to the floor? Maybe she knew she couldn't run anymore. And she chose to take her own life. Wait, look down though, is she really there? Didn't think this would happen. Whoa, what? I feel safer now. It's over. I don't think so. We should go check. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I keep saying what they're saying. <laughs> like one second before I see it. Um, we approached a broken window and looked down. No way, is she gone? How? I approached Senna and I looked down as well, and then... Nothing but broken glass? What? How the fuck is this game gonna explain this? What? Okay. She's nowhere to be seen. Is this really happening? Still dreaming? I don't know what's going on. I only know one thing. This case isn't over yet. <laughs> Fear and confusion. I feel like I'm about to lose my mind. Yeah, this is... Uh, Jesus. Oh, self-question time. Okay. Let's look over what just happened. Third case. She got her ear chewed off. Yeah. And she lost sight of her right eye. But those kind of optic nerves are not going through the ear. So how did she lose sight of her eye? I think she must have done something. Oh, uh, maybe psychological, yeah. Just like the trauma is that big that she... she yeah. That happens to people, I think. She was so emotionally shaken that she went blind in one eye. Yeah. I think that would be a good explanation, right? So that means physically nothing's wrong with her, but she could still, yeah, the side of her eye. I like that. Then, I'm still like taking the rational road. 
the fourth case. Her right foot got amputated. Um, the couple in the second case only got cut, but in this case it got amputated. Why is that? Um, Itaburu? Because she wanted to- I still think like keeping- sticking to the urban legend is the most important thing. Yeah, so it has to fit the story that she wants to recreate. Yeah, so modeled after Kashima, that would be her reason to amputate the leg, the foot. Um, yep, she wanted to become Kashima. Yeah, so is the culprit really that uh, extreme to go to that length to recreate an urban legend? Then why did she show up here? That's true, I was confused about that because it doesn't fit the story. Maybe she was- ooh! Maybe she was trying to stop the, the dude from spilling the beans. Maybe he saw something he wasn't supposed to. The Yazawa dude. Maybe. I like that one. The fourth case's victim and the witness were here. Maybe she was trying to silence them. We visited here and we talked to Yazawa. Okay. It's the second time we've seen her since the park. I, th I guess it's the same one, yeah. Because I first thought maybe it's like different people working together to recreate all of these things and that way those third and fourth case can happen at exactly the same time if it's multiple culprits, but... Um, okay, so she got kicked but even then she didn't really seem hurt and she jumped from the 10th floor and disappeared. How can I explain this? Drugs? Or a monster. <sighs> I don't like either. I'll go with drugs because I like to take the realism approach. She might be under the influence of some drug. So she doesn't feel pain from Senna's attack. Yeah, maybe. But how did she jump from the 10th floor? Yeah. Yeah, how did she do that? Did she maybe enter a, a window halfway down that was open? We have to take a scientific approach. We have to take an occult approach. We still have the DNA test from the hair that's supposed to come back. That should link us to an actual person. Wanna keep our cool. We have to take the scientific approach. If we, lean, if we lean towards the supernatural, we're taking uh, the easy way out? Is that what that means? I saw the characters before, but I forgot what they meant. Um, okay, so we have the woman in the trench coat, we have the victims. And she took a drop kick from Senna. <laughs> that was amazing. <laughs> um, all those things make you think that she's not human. And okay, I explained my thoughts to Senna. But how did she? 
how was she able to fall from this height? A normal human being wouldn't be able to do that. That, well, that only means if she actually landed on the ground. But we didn't see it. Yeah. Maybe she... She got me to it. Hmm, not sure. Maybe she was under some drugs. She can do all kinds of things beyond the human capabilities limits. Maybe. Her speed and strength. Her toughness. Toughness. <laughs> yeah, she is something, that's for sure. Maybe she's a robot. <laughs> um, I know what Sina means. It's pretty hard to keep it on the scientific side. We can't just uh, stay, keep standing here. We have to go do stuff. Yeah, things have to progress. That's our duty as detectives. <gasps> Are we gonna go to chapter two? Holy shit! Yeah, let's save. I'll make a new one. Yes. Ooh, much excited. I want the DNA results. I want them to tell me that it's a wig. But what if it's a human hair wig? You have those too. If the culprit's really smart, then that's what they're gonna do. So this is the halfway point of the game. Holy shit. I did it. I made it to a halfway point. <laughs> um, okay. What we don't know... I don't know how to translate that. Okay. So... When can we go back? Too dangerous. Can't deny the supernatural, but I don't want to lean in that direction. What's important is to find a balance. She's smart. I like her. Uh, we can't stray too far from the truth. But we might, we might find hints that lead back to the truth. Ooh. If we follow those, those hints, we might, we'll find the culprit. I don't want to deny the urban legends or the supernatural, but we have to take the scientific approach. I look straight at Seno and I say it. Looks like he's thinking about something, but he nods. Got it. That's what you want to do? I'll go along. Ah, oh, thank you, Senna. Ah ha ha! Hi! Okay. I thank him and he shows me a big smile. Ah. You don't have to thank me for something like that. Oh, cute. No traces. Well, she held the the dude's head in her hand, though. So isn't there any marks on the head then? Or anything, like, any traces left behind? Not even a drop of blood from jumping out of the window. No witnesses either. There are people that looked up uh, as soon as the window broke and they didn't even see any anything, any person or whatever. So how how is that possible? Are we tricked? Is it just an illusion that she broke the window? Was the window rigged to break maybe? 
Senna is like tilting his head because he's thinking and he doesn't understand what's how to explain it. I look at the window. I look at look down. Mm. One thing is certain. A normal person can't drop down from the tenth floor and be okay. Maybe she didn't fall all the way down, but went into another floor as she went down. I slowly look up from the ground. From the tenth floor, none of the- all of the windows are shut. Well, of course she would have closed it after she went in. They're all closed. Um, not even a sign of any window being broken. So she jumped out. Between the times she jumped out and Senna checked was only one minute. That's long though, a long minute. Well, I guess if you think that she's... Well, we did hear a thump, didn't we? Of something falling. Hmm. Maybe she jumped out, luckily found an open window, and jumped in without anyone seeing her. Yeah, it's, it's too much of a stretch. Hmm. Can that really happen? Doesn't seem like a real, a possible, a possible reality. Two letters, characters come up in my head. The ones of, that it's a mystery. Or strange in English, I guess. Okay. We just decided we wanted to take the scientific approach, but now we're already stuck. Hey. He pats me on the back. That hurts. What are you doing? <laughs> Don't give up yet. We're about to. St we're only about to start. Yeah, you're right. Oh, he's trying to encourage me. <laughs> I take a deep breath. To find some new motivation. Okay. <laughs> Didn't imagine being encouraged by you. <laughs> oh, he's calling me partner again. Oh, don't do it. Ah, uh, she feels very confused, but at the same time relieved. Oh, poor girl. Oh, we're going back. Maybe now we get the DNA back. We finish up everything at the hospital and come back to the main office, police office. Um, at the entrance, Tanaka is waiting for us. Uh, Okay. His thinning hair again. I've never seen a, a more pitiful something as him. I forgot what the Neo was for again. Hello, <laughs> Sal. Doesn't he look angry to you? Yeah, he does. Well, he looks the same to me. Um, when he notices us, his uh, shoulders perk up again. He's like, whoo! Chota, chota, chota! <laughs> um, nante koto. So, what the hell have you been up to? Ha? Ha, 
じゃないでしょう。<笑> so don't you hurt me? <笑> He's angry. Oh. Yes, I was sun cold. Oh, fuck. We fucking saved his life, though. Jesus, ungrateful Brett. <sighs> He told us what? He even went as far as to say that we should be fired. We fucking saved his life, asshole. Jesus. Oh, I fucking hate that kid. Uh. I thought he would do that. And. Okay, so he didn't. He didn't let me down. Yazawa. He doesn't betray my feelings. <laughs> yeah, I don't mean it in a good way. Keh. Yeah, what a pitiful brat. <laughs> He should just say it in our faces if he has, if he has complaints. Okay. Yeah, he doesn't. Oh. <laughs> Now he's getting nervous because he's like. You guys should be. You guys should feel bad about this. And we're like, just fucking idiot. <laughs> um, I don't want to know what you guys did to him, but. Yeah, I'm responsible for you guys. I think that's what he's saying. Yare, yare. This dude. Jesus. Everyone's so tiring. Okay, we have to get along with him for now. Okay, well, excuse us, we're still in the middle of investigation. This is our chance to run. I bow and head for the door. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Tanaka don't know, doesn't know what, what, he, what he's supposed to say. This is our chance to go. Okay. DNA? Only have two more minutes. <sighs> Tanaka got involved. Yeah, the fucking Yazawa. Fucking hate him. Jesus. Okay. Uh, we should just ignore people like Yazawa. Yeah. I, I really can't believe that he did that, even though we saved him. Um. Yeah, so his father has a lot of influence because he's a member of the Diet. We know that. Oh, yeah, the chief had flowers in the hospital room as well. What about him? Hmm. Wow, so many characters. I don't know what this says. I'll just move on. <laughs> I'll work on it later. <laughs> um, don't want to go along with Tanaka either. Don't want to apologize to Yazawa at all. Uh, we should leave the the politics up to Tanaka, and we just will we'll just continue with the investigation. The analysis from the hair should be back. Yes, yes. Give it to me. 
<laughs> mm? What's wrong? Sina st suddenly stops walking on the spot. That foreigner. Oh no, is there a foreigner? <sighs> please don't let it be a stereotype. Please. Please. Uh, I follow Senna's, where Senna, Senna's eyes, where he's looking to. Um, and there's a blonde dude, of course he's blonde. Okay. Standing there. Oh, he's coming this way. Oh, well, let's see it. Holy shit, you're creepy. <laughs> Holy fuck, you're straight out of Dark Souls. Woof. Okay. He's like Prince Lothric or something. <laughs> um, this is gonna be the final screen, so let's read it. He's wearing a, a very expensive suit. His hair is all blonde and shiny. And his face is super symmetrical. Beautiful. Okay. Well. We'll see what this guy has to say in the next episode. And then finally get the DNA results. Okay. See you guys soon with more. Bye!